welcome to my new tutorial today i want to show you how you to make this circular hole in a curved surface i don't want to waste the time let's get right started first we need an object where we make can make the hole in so i use a quad sphere here why do i need a quad sphere because the quad faces are perfect uh, for using subdivisions because they give a great smooth result. So first of all I'm gonna change this cut field to a curved surface. How will I do this? I just select here proportional editing and then I just pulling out some vertices here. So that's enough. So I'll now choose a place where I want to make the hole. I choose this one here. Then I press Ctrl B to bevel and V to vertex bevel. Then I draw this out a bit. And then I go here down in the pop-up dialog here and choose two segments and I get something like this. I make sure that I have enabled the loop tools here. And if you have this enabled, you can press F3 to search for Mesh Loop Tools Circle. Then you get this nice circle here. Then I'm going to select these uh, vertices and press J to cut the face. So I'm getting uh, quads again, as you can see, because I lost them because I made this here. So if you now watch this, you have here quad faces again. That's great, that's what we want to have. Now I select this middle again and now I'm going to press I to inset to make a support loop and by holding shift I can change the, the width of it and uh, I choose something like this and then I press E to extrude and I would shift again to make another support loop then I press E again to extrude, push this down, then E again to extrude again just a little bit by holding shift. And then I press I again to make an inset, then I'm already ready. And this looks not too perfect, but watch this just now at subdivision surface modifier with two or three levels and now you see exact result I showed you in the beginning. You have a nice circular loop. I hope you learned something. I hope you have fun. Bye.